Well, good afternoon and welcome to my workshop. Now this is just a very quick uh, video to follow up on my bass guitar build and um, it's really a bit of a snagging uh, video because there are a couple of things wrong with the build um, that I talked about in the last video. Right now the first thing that's wrong with this guitar is the mixer section here. When I turn either of the pickups down I lose the sound from the system and of course that's because the pickups are both being earthed so I need to turn them both up and then just drop them slightly to get the different tones. So that's the first thing that's wrong with it. The second thing that's wrong with it is I need longer screws to bring these pickups up. I've just pulled this one up. So I'm very grateful to Moller Amp Works and Crucible Guitars, I'll put a link to their channel below, for uh, telling me how to fix the problem with the two volume controls. So I'm going to get that fixed. And I'm also grateful to uh, CH Guitars who supply all my pickups for responding really quickly to my request for some extra screws. Some long screws for the pickups and um, I've got those. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. Let's get on. Now I'm going to have to remove these two volume controls and they've got to come out of the jack socket hole there and I'm hoping that the wire is long enough such that I don't actually need to unplug the pickups in which case I don't need to take the strings off or anything like that. That's what I'm hoping so I'll just get this taken off. Now the problem with this is getting these two controls out and then back in again. So I've marked the front one with red pen and uh, so I know which one's which and I'm just hoping I, I can pull them out with the wire and then I'll have to put some string on again to get them back in again. So let's just see if we can do this. There's not a lot of room in there, not a lot of room at all. Okay, so let me give you a quick explanation of the problem and it's obvious when you uh, sit down and look at it. At the moment I've got the output jack wired to the central tag and that's uh, effectively the spindle here, the, uh, the wiper. So that when the wiper is in the very low position, effectively the jack is grounded. And because the jack is also connected to the other pickup, the two join up together there, then the other pickup is grounded. So no volume out of the guitar. So what I need to do is to swap these over so that the, the pickup goes to the wiper and this output goes to the other tag there. Then there will always be a resistance uh, between the earth and the output. So there should never be a situation then where I'm earthing the, the, uh, the output jack. Let's give it a go and see if it works. Okay, well I've plugged it in the amplifier, made those changes. So uh, let's ramp up the volume on both pickups. Start off with. And now um, I'll turn down the neck pickup. So we're just getting this one, not that one, and I'll turn down the other one, turn up the uh, neck, so now it's the neck pickup, not the bridge. Nothing. So, and I can blend the two. Brilliant. Okay, so all I've got to do now is get these two 
back in there. Phew. Oh, I'll tell you what, this is really fiddly. It's taken me ages to get that first one in. Let's see if this second one goes in any easier. First time round, they both went in really simply. But they didn't want to go back in again. Now it's a question of getting the washer and the nut on without dropping the thing through into the body. Okay, before I go any further, I'm going to test it again. And uh, well, that was working and it stopped now. Oh. Okay, both got to come out again. Just got to have patience. Well, I'll be honest, I have no idea why it didn't work the first time round because there was nothing that had come unsoldered or anything like that. Um, but anyway, well, yeah, it's working now. So uh, no sound, bridge, a neck, and a blend. So that bit's done. You know, some days, ladies and gentlemen, things just don't go right. And I've over tightened this pot and broke the top off. <sighs> so, I think it's time for a cup of tea. Well, a cup of tea and the world's okay. So now I've got, I've got some tone out of the uh, neck. Bridge. So I'm just putting the uh, long screws in now and uh, well then that should be done. Excellent. I do like the idea of the hollow body guitar because you've got no plate to worry about but obviously it is a bit of a fiddle when you're trying to get pots controls pickups etc into the guitar but I think it's worthwhile in the end and um, yeah and it sounds nice so, well, that's it. That's the snagging done, for the time being anyway. <laughs> um, the, the neck seems to be pretty solid. It's, it is quite a thick neck and um, I've left it thick because I want it to be stable uh, and I'm quite happy with that. But otherwise, yeah, it's looking good. Well, thank you for watching this short video. I'll see you soon. In the meantime, stay safe. Cheers.